and this is Cyborg Monkey, and today I will be going through the steps on how to fix your channel art so it doesn't pop up the image saying, uh, this image is too small, it has to be at least 1480 by, I don't remember, but if you have had a channel and tried to edit your channel art, you've probably gone through this issue. So today I, uh, I actually figured it out, so I'm gonna have this video to help you guys through the process on what to do. And the best part is, I will be showing how to do this on Mac and Windows. So currently I am using a Mac, but I shall just tell you what to do if you're on Windows as well. Okay, first. First step, you're gonna wanna find a image you want. So let's just look here. Oh, that's a cute little image. So actually, all right, let's use a bigger picture. So this is a pretty big picture, right? 2000 by 2008, 640 by 21627. But first, let me show you what happens if you try to do it by itself. So let's, let's use this picture, save image as, you can just save it as monkey channel art. All right. So we can just save that to downloads or wherever you want to find your picture, wherever is easiest for you. And this does say 2864 2, by 2127. 2, All right, which is above what you should actually need and what you should use. So it says it has to be at least that number, which is definitely less than what we have. So we're just gonna try to find that picture in our downloads here. Here it is, monkey channel art right at the top. And once this loads, all right, we're gonna open it. Now we're gonna see if it works. What do you know? It does not work. Your photo you upload is, upload is too small, it has to be at least 2,000 48 pixels wide and 1,152 pixels tall. Now, to fix this, what you're gonna need to do is open up Finder if you're on a Mac or Documents, uh, Windows, uh, Windows Explorer, wherever you keep your uh, image or wherever you saved it last. It could be your desk desktop, it could be anywhere. So I just saved mine to my Finder on Mac. So what you need to do on both types of computers, you just need to right click it and then scroll down to where it says open with. And here you're going to want to open preview, which is the default for Mac or paint, Windows paint or yeah, it should be called paint on Windows. So you're just going to want to open that up. And the truth is you guys, once I go into here, you will see why it does not work. Look how tiny this picture is. Google, you lied. What is this? Okay, but there is a way to fix it. Once you have preview or paint open, you're going to want to scroll up to the top where it says, um, tools. You're going to want to go to the toolbar where, and then click the bar that says tools and scroll down until you see adjust size and this is the same on paint or it should say something like adjust size similar so you're just gonna want to open that and here's where it gets a little complicated so you're gonna want to pay attention originally my computer had it set on inches which is not what you want you want it to be set to pixels okay so set your little thing to pixels. I don't know what it's called. So next, you're going to want to unclick scale proportionally or on a Windows computer, you're going to want to unclick aspect ratio. That is aspect ratio. Okay. And now this is where you can be kind of creative and do how it whatever you want. But for me, I'm just going to use the sizes. 2480, I mean 2048 by 1152, okay? And now that it is like this, all you have to do is just push okay, and voila, 
your picture has changed to a bigger size. But there is an issue, and that is that the quality is horrible. But that is something you can't really do, and also, I don't know if you can do this in paint, but you can like add text to it, like subscribe, like all that stuff. But for now, I'm not gonna do that. I'm just going to file save. And now that it has saved, just to be sure. Okay, now I can X out of that and X out of uh, documents or finder, wherever you keep your pictures. If the computer loads, all right. And now we are able to select a photo from your computer, download your new edited thing, your new edited uh, channel art, that's what it's called. Okay, so you're gonna pop it open and it should load uploading there we go and voila it has worked and then you can always uh adjust it how you want on uh on paint or uh preview so yeah but of course if you do use it it's not gonna be very good quality like uh i'll see if it'll show yeah that's like not good quality it, but the picture did start at a very small image, so when you're looking for a channel art, you're going to either want to use a uh, big, just blank color, or just a big picture to start with. And I'm just going to... I think this is the one I used. Yep. Just going to select that and put it back, and I edited it, edited it, edited it, edited it so that it would fit on phones and everything. And I just used a plain yellow background with black text, pretty simple. But that is where it is up to you. And remember, don't try not to use two small images because then the quality will be very bad. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this helped you guys figure it out. I know it was very frustrating for me. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'm Cyborg Monkey, and I'm out. Peace.